Hello ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I'm the Nerdbird and welcome back to Dune Star Shipwrecked. That's right, the game where we try not to get our faces eaten. And I did a dum-dum and I died. So let's start again and hopefully we can get a better start than we did last time. Where I had to search everywhere for gold and then screwed up. I'm going to see we're still playing Willow. This, well, I think Willow is the best one for this one, just because of oh, Willow's lighter. It does make it easier. But with dying, I also did unlock the strongman. Which, if I die again, I may just use that as a playthrough on my next one. So we're going to see if we got lucky and got an island with some gold on it. Probably didn't. Because I'm probably not that lucky. And it looks like we are going to have to go sailing. Which means we're going to have to build ourselves a boat. Because this... like a little tiny island. As usual, ladies and gentlemen, if you like what you see, make sure to hit the like button and hit subscribe. It's been a little bit since my last video due to real life stuff and, well, XCOM 2. XCOM 2 basically took over a big chunk of my available time because, well, XCOM 2. Shall we go? I think we might head north. Well. Stupid crabs. Let's build a little raft. And we'll try to find ourselves an island with gold before it gets dark. Looks like we've got ourselves some land over here. Let's just hope this is a better island than our last one was.
As long as we don't find an island full of monkeys, I'll be happy. We do have a mangrove area, which means there might be beefalo around. Looks like we found ourselves another desert island. I think we're about as lucky as we usually are in that there's no gold, no gold, no gold. It's a beehive. No gold, no gold. No gold, no gold. Well, it's good to see we're about as lucky as you normally are. Ah, crap. Leave me alone, you jerk. You just burn to death. Thank you. But on a side note, looky what we found. Saving, saving. We found us some gold. Which means now we can make yourself a science machine. Just a little creepy. Sort of feel sad for them now. But it's okay because they're going to be tasty, tasty, tasty. Get ourselves some crabs. We found ourselves some treasure. At 
at least we will. Monkeys. Oh, it had to be monkeys. But we did find ourselves a little resurrection thing. Which is always good, because this way if we die this time, we will... Be able to resurrect. some coconuts. Stupid monkeys will probably take that. Oh. Why can't I cook that? Make ourselves another boot, shall we? <laughs> Stupid monkeys taking all my damn stuff. Head down south, see if we can find. That had to be the weirdest looking fish I ever seen. Oh no. I think I might have made another dum dum. I don't think I'm going to get down there before it is night time. And now we're starting to get waterlogged. But we'll see how far we can get. land this way, or at least the water is more shallow. get to some land. And we'll build ourselves a fire. Get ourselves dried off. Oh, I need more wood for that. 
Cut more wood, I mean, I need more stone. I think we will try to make this island our camp because there is lots of crabs. At least our first camp. Because on this one there is a fair bit of available food. And then we'll go down and see what's on that southern island. Now I can build a fire pit. Drop them there. I guess is where we'll leave this one and when I get back when we come back we will go searching for the treasure it's been the Nerdbird make sure to hit subscribe and like have a good one